It's actually the title of an existing game. Oh. <gasps> go ship, go ship, go ship. That is fucking mega ghost ship, ghost ship. That is the best fucking ghost ship I've ever fucking seen. And it also has the little blue flamies. I am, I am resplendent. Oh, fuck me. Last night we got our Legend of Zelda ghost ship with the blue flamies and tonight we get our fucking Legend of Dragoon ghost ship with the blue flamies. This is fucking fantastic. Oh my god! Look at those sails! They are ragged and billowing. Shiver me timbers. Oh my god, this is so cool. Well, fuck, you see, if it were Legend of Zelda, it would have been okay. It would have just gone through you. That is fucking mega. Oh, my God. Best FMV I've ever fucking seen. <laughs> it was so cool. Holy shit. I love it. They made this massive steel ship like the sea dragon won't get us now. Go ship like. What? <laughs> don't ship ghosts around these parts, Luna. Let the dead lay as they may. <laughs> Do you have the map to find your way on the ghost ship, though? They must have the map, and that's why the ghost ship crashed into them. It sucks. What on earth is this? I can't believe this. What are you doing? Get back to your stations and check on the damages. Why is Twitch Club so bad? Oh, that absolutely amazing face. Trip. Thank you. Hi, hi, Captain. Oh, oh, oh! We get a zoom in on his hat. Thank you, Connie. <laughs> Congo's gonna go up to the ghost ship. Like, is this friends? <laughs> There is a heraldry. It looks like a royal ship of Mil Saiso. Is this like a phantom ship? Oh boy. <laughs> Commodore, bad news. It caught the engine room. Kayla, let them hurry to fix it. Hi, aye, aye, sir. We cannot pursue Lennox like this. You're so matter of a fact, Mark. It was a really fucking cool ship, Aru. <laughs> Sometimes the ocean shows us capricious. I, I, I love this captain. He's so sea obsessed. All I can think of is Yu Gi Oh! Bridge and Mako Tsunami. <laughs> right, Ocean? Why would you answer me, Ocean? <laughs> But I've never seen such a thing. Wait for a while. There is nothing we can do now. It's just such a slut for the sea. A brotion of the ocean. This, this ship is... You okay, Rose? That's a lot of ellipsis. Dot, I can't find Shana anywhere. <gasps> Rose, is that you? Yeah. Oh no, wait, that was Shana. Help! She's fine. Where am I? <gasps> oh shit. Does that ghost have a top hat and a monocle and a cane? Turn around, let me see you. No, no. We've got a ghost with a top hat and a cane. There you go, there you go, cunning. <laughs> oh my god. Hell yeah! Ah. Ah. She swoon. No, wait. These these are her golden protectors of some sort. Shauna. Must be.
Yo! Why did you come here? I... I don't know! When I woke up, I was in here. Those knights... protected me. They... are gone, though. At least you are safe and sound. Come on, come on! We're here already, so we may as well just take some tour here. I love the I love the syntax of these sentences. No way. I want to go too. I don't know why, but I want to know about the ship. Oh, please. We'll go with them. Then it won't be a problem. Okay, but if anything happens, we must go back. Whee. Where's Kongol and Hashel? I lost him. Oh no, we good. Hmm. Well, uh... Somehow, Meru is level 20. Let's swap out Rose and then put in Albert, just for kicks. What? What? Oh god, I thought Google picked up on me again. Don't do that. Oh gosh, should I should I dive into the orbs or will it murder me straight away? Come here. Yeah. Oh my god. I wanted to see the battleground, you see. <gasps> Pretty. I fucking love a teal light. Oh no. Everything's gonna have like fear effect or something, isn't it? No? Okay, not quite. Murders Luna straight away. Ah, oh, well, that's me fucked. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. We're on a ghost ship. It's really fucking cool. No, I didn't want a guard. Oh, well. Too late. I've done it now. Leave him alone. Okay. Um. Go, Mary, go. Hey, Double snap. Yeah. That was awful. How are you level 20? What are your skills, Maru? I need to know. Yes. Oh, he missed. I need to know why why your, your attacks aren't great, but your, your level's quite good. There's a mist. Oh my god! I didn't notice that! One of the wisps are actually just little blue eyeballs! Oh, I don't like it. They look much nicer from the back. They look, look more Willow the Wispy. Oh, beans. Uh, how about trans rights? Oh, no way. It's just death. It's just death. Okay. Okay. Well, let's let's go. I'm gonna murder death with trans right. Your fucking obituary to me, Belmont. <laughs> He's going to stop me. You and your silly bit of string. <sighs> fucking hell, that was nice. Got him. Oh. New meaning to keeping an eye out. Go ship, go ship, go ship. Thank you, sir. Kill death? Wow, that's so passe. I'm gonna kill chaos. Oh, I missed it. Oh, well. You killed death. Does that mean you're death now? Part of the ship, part of the crew. Noise. Beautiful. I'm proud of me. Always was. I always forget that Keck doesn't work here. I'm sorry, Sophie. I'm sorry, Sophie. I'm sorry. We could make it work. At this point, we see the Keck W and we know we see the face. I just forget. I forget what the people want. Whee! But did you know that you can hold me to account by joining the Discord and saying what you want in the channel suggestions? Then when I don't do it, you can be all like, Luna, it's in the fucking suggestions. Check it. Dickhead. 
Have some coffee on ghost ships. Ooh, ghost coffee sounds like a really edgy brand that I would totally buy based on the name. And maybe the cute cup designs and stuff. But I'd be like, yep, that's coffee. It was a really cool ghost ship. You trying to tell me that it's not? Luna has become death. I am fire. I am death. Damn. If I'd have known that we were going to be doing so much fighting on the ghost ship, though, I would have bought more trans rights with me. Followed us from Wind Waker, damn it. It really did. It's even got, like, the blue wispies. I was like, wow, a go another ghost ship? Who knows what it will look like? Could be quite green greenish, like the Flying Dutchman. Could be like the Okami ship. Nah. Try to sell Luna an empty mug. Yes, ghost coffee. <laughs> oh, that's a good prank. We'll get more translate then. Well, I can't do that right now. I don't think the ghost ship has a has a shop that that sells the translates. Yay! Do I need to switch up some of my skills now so I can go level 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 the additions? I mean, I might need to. I'll have a gander. Congrats to Hashel. Okay. Oops. Mary, what happened? Fuck. Uh. Oh, I'm so tempted to swap her out. Okay. Okay. We need to put the double slash back on because we are so close to completing Party that. Crap. I'll take that. How much? Read the light novel. Did you really? Did you genuinely? Thank you so, so much for the prime. You now have the three month badge. Ah. Now you gotta wait another three months for the next one. But you will not have to wait that long for even more emotes, which you have access to now. Thank you so, so much. Oh yeah, no additions for Shana. Ever, ever, ever. <gasps> she got another one. We need to level this though. Um, Cashels. Got some real good leveling going on here. Um, uh, fuck. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Genuinely, like, the light novel looks interesting. Where's my special 22 month badge? Do I have that option? I can't remember what the tier list for the options is. Hmm. When do you get the, the latest badge? I followed two years ago this Thursday. Wait a minute. You don't have it either? Who's got it? Give me a second. Is it two years? Does it have to be two years for it to for it to be the latest badge? I, I guess it does. Huh. Yeah, two years. I just thought it was hard blade, not hardened blade. Well, it's just what my copy says. Maybe, maybe they changed it again. I mean, I had that weird thing going on where like, I don't know why they do this sometimes because I just end up thinking, <sighs> but you've already then just used the rest of obviously what the American team has done with the, with the translations, but for, for this one, they they had him say, like, Mum M-U-M rather than, like, Mum M-O-M. And I'm just like, you may as well have just left it. May as well have just left it. Two years is the latest. You owe us two and a half, and soon three. There's only, like, several of you with that badge at all. That's a lot of pressure. Fran! Where do you even find these games to play? I just, I, I have people who suggest things or like I'll, I'll look through old retro lists or something. This ghost ship is mega. We saw the FMV and it was mm, sublime. 
I'm doing pretty okay. I've been a little bit manic. Um, been a little bit freaking exhausted. I did not get a proper rest this weekend. I probably won't get a proper rest today. But you know, I'll hopefully manage to just do all of my freaking work. I did my I did my first YouTube video. It was a big old shit post of a video, but it was done. So I finally got a stream anniversary reward. Cleared from the list of things that I haven't done since last year. Um, also, it's just like a nice little opportunity to do like a little bit of uh, video editing, which I hope that I'll do more of in the future. Um, anything else? There are other things, but these are the most immediate things. How have you been? I hope you had fun with your friends. I catch up on the Instagram stories. I'm all like, oh, what's everyone doing? Ah, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Currently snuggling under the blankets. Yes. Like I, I uh. Yes. I was thinking because of one of the stories, that whole thing of um. It's my birthday's at the end of the month, and I'm like, oh, what am I doing for it? Part of me was like, mm, maybe I will go for like the the cupcake arrangement. But mm, I think it'll be easier for me to just like make a whole cake. But I was inspired. It's next weekend, but we're going to be in Budapest for it. Ah, okay. How long for? I hope it is an easy journey and a good time. Go Gosh. get him. That was awful. I was so eager to murder death that I just missed him completely, clearly. Thank you, SP. It was not... It was not my finest work, but actually, if you think about it, because of the fact that I have not done any other YouTube videos, it is my finest work so far. And that's a nice, exciting phrasing. What day's your birthday? My, my day, uh, Saturday, it's on the 26th. Oh God, it's not like, I'm lucky enough to have picked up um, Vegas Pro 15 from a Humble Bundle, so. Like, I've, I've got a lot of help there, and things are quite smooth and manageable for me. It just takes so much time. And, like, the, the ideas going on, I'm all like, oh, I don't know. Ah, blah. Like, uh, <laughs> I had an idea that I, I, I should have done as well. There's various things I'm like, wow, I wish if it hadn't been such a stressful process to record and everything that I could have done this. But um, rather than have the text, flashes occasionally I would have done just like flashes of my crying face <laughs> it feels so ridiculous like I keep saying it's it's like how can it be taking every time that I go and sit down to do editing how could it have taken an hour for me to edit three minutes how that's not how it should work less than gotta save those ideas for future bits yeah I believe, because I um I still have a couple of um video ideas that I definitely want to try out. It's the same birthday as my mum. Sick. I don't know what to do with this information. It's just interesting. Like, sure, you know, in your brain space, lots of people share your birthday, or like the birthday of someone you know. But then you meet them, and then you find out, and you're like, oh. It just means you'll remember my birthday forever now. Sorted. I'm a wretch. I, I only ever end up remembering people's star signs rather than their actual birth dates. Because it's easier. Hi. It's just easier for me to remember symbols than it is numbers. <laughs> oh, why do I keep running into the wisps? Like, I will say, the only thing that I'm not always enjoying about this game is that the animations are quite slow so sometimes combat feels like a massive chore because i'm just like well could have got through that a little bit faster couldn't we that makes you an aries right it does one of the earliest aries i'm happy that i can remember my own birthday <laughs> mm -hmm. two of the streamers i watch on a daily basis turned out to share my birthday makes me wonder if there's a conspiracy going wait Am I one of the two? Or am I being self-centered? And you're like, this isn't about you. This isn't about you, moth. Yes. Double flash. Ugh, why do I have to level this? 
Hashtag ver ver gang. numbers now. Bone throwing. I'd rather you didn't. Ugh. Rude. Leave me be. You're not one of the two. This ain't about you, Moth. You're one of the very few streamers I watch whenever you're live, though, if that makes a difference. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, wait. That's... Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I was, I was focused on the birthday thing. Thank you so, so much. Awkward now. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, that was me. Why? Why do you get a special little thing to say that you're bone throwing? Maybe they do for every attack, and I just haven't noticed. Hmm. I mean, what? We're we're dark timeline Luna now. Um, don't don't. None of you who also stream use your emotes in my chat. That's self promotion. There you go. I'm full dark side now. I'm so jealous of people born this year on the 22nd of the 2nd, 2022. Oh my gosh. I didn't think of all the babies born on the Tuesday. I already did. Well, I usually get to ask to leave when I start throwing my bone. <laughs> oh, that was awful. Oh, for God's sake. <sighs> um, at least Albert's getting all this spirit energy. Shame none of his skills heal. Do you want? Do you want our one potion, Mary? We're more about the healing breeze these days rather than the healing potion. Unacceptable! But that's the one. Don't get hit. <laughs> That's a lot of mallets. Why <sighs> I'm making this last longer by refusing to uh, lock after myself properly, I guess. Right. Heal up, don't die. Go away! At least we're actually still not losing all of the health that we're healing up again. Yes! There was a period that was like that. It was a terrible time. Virgos are the worst, am I right? I can't remember loads about Virgos. Wow, they're gonna take my flipping license off of me. I don't know what the license is for, but... I think uh, an element of tidiness is a thing. Shana. Okay. Where are we going on the ship now? I'm leaving. I can't be stopped. You'd think that would be a lot. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh no. Oh no. We're ruined. No, we're okay. I did it. I survived ghost, ghost ball ping pong. Oh. Are they actually gonna come out again? Okay. Okay. That... Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Tidiness? I think I failed that exam. <laughs> oh no. What? If anything actually popped out, I missed it. Oh, we actually have to fight, don't we? Ah. As a Libra, I am passively aggressively sitting here. Mm -hmm. Better make that decision soon. Whatever it is. Better stay on the fence to keep peace. <laughs> Get away from me, fence. Uh-uh. <laughs> oh, fuck. She's dying. I should have... Oh, it's gonna be okay. Let's get the dragoons out. We haven't seen a little magical girl transformation for a little while. Make up. Okay. Uh. Do 
do this one. It's so pretty. I'm losing it. I'm trying to keep up, but I'm. Whew. I really burned myself out in the first two hours of the stream, huh? It's all that weebism. Rotted my brain. Right, don't die. Don't die, Mario. Some brand of you for you to get lost to. Yeah, yeah. Weebism is bad for your health, folks. It is. You know what? I, I don't think that I can. It's not a medically sound idea for me to watch any more anime. Forget everything I said. Yeah, you've been very energetic this stream. Yeah, I really burned myself out. I'm like, Christ, shut up, Luna. What's wrong with you? What? What are you? R ranking your kid? Oh. I can't. It's not medically sound for my health. It's rotted my brain. It's so good. I'm supposed to be reading manga recommendation list for a spicy relationship drama. Never seen in the animes. Yeah. Now keep going, Winnie. You're amazing. <gasps> Anthony, you're amazing. You're wonderful. <laughs> My weebism. It's it's coming back and I don't know why. It lay dormant for so long and now I'm going around doing things like <laughs> infecting Anthony's stream with when you're on a chicken bender have a box of chicken tenders. How are you doing? What have you been up to today? Luna, don't flag. I'm flagging. I need some coffee. Again, sleep. I went. I went to window watch. No. Oh wait, shit. Is there all of the stuff outside still? Fish break. You better all be good. <gasps> Fish. Hello. How are you? I hope you're well. New video. I became a weave, not clickbait. <laughs> Just like how uh, DMC2 greatest of all time was not clickbait. I love my thumbnail. There's a few places where I've like gone to put the video down and it hasn't shown the thumbnail that I made for it. And I'm like, this is a crime. This is criminal. I love my, I love my ship post thumbnail. Is this haunted ship everything you wished it would be? Yeah. We got death. We got will of the wisps. We've got glowy blue lights all over the shop. I love it. You know what? This entire color palette and like the the glowiness, I think that's the entire reason that I enjoyed Atlantis The Lost Empire so much. No other reason. Don't need another reason. It glow. It popped up on the tweet. Good. That's the important thing. If it didn't pop up on the tweet, then I'd truly be quite irate, shall we say. That was pathetic. I love when it comes up as mist, but they'll still make the <laughs> noises. Thanks, coming. Had to stay off work, so I was able to catch a stream. Might get a box of chicken tenders. How are you doing? I'm great. I um, I'm. Today's level of tiredness has just been spiraling into madness and general overly chattiness. Like, damn, what haven't we spoken about today? So many things. So many topics. Oh. The manic squirrel that lives in my head. She's been off on one so hard. Hello. Oh, thank you so, so much. That's really sweet. I wasn't ready. I'm swaying, thinking about coffee, and you're coming in with the lovely words. Thank you so, so much. Coffee time soon? More coffee time. I'm, I'm surviving off of the dregs at the minute. I'm proud of 
helpful of you. You're welcome in. Luna's cry tired. Quick, I'm not cry tired. Who would suggest such a thing? You'd be wrong. Yes. Double flash. Need more coffee. Though. Pharaoh. <gasps> Pharaoh. Oh my God. You you disappeared. I'm sorry. I'm blind as a bat. I think because the shout out came like after the socials on my brain. Actually, you know what? Let's never try and make excuses for my brain. It's broken. We all know this. Hello, I love you. I'm so sorry. I saw you. I didn't see your initial hi. I like to be sneaky. It's very easy to be sneaky with me. How are you? What time did you wake up? Haha, <laughs> you're a good pal. Ha. Ha. I feel like this day is really dragging on. Legend of dra dragon. Legend of coffee drags. I nah, I forget about it. You know what? I, I do need to think of certain titles in advance, but I just... That one wasn't going anywhere, was it? Give me a minute. I didn't even get to move. Oh, beans. Oh, no. <laughs> Hi, Elsie. <laughs> uh, hurry up. Okay. I woke up at one, then decided today was not a stream day. Took another hour nap and studying chore day. Oh, I need a chore day. I I thought that there were various things where I was like, it's okay. I, it's, it's okay. I won't have to worry about it. But I, I stressed myself out a lot this morning, even just like trying to find, find something to wear. So, wait, what? Wasn't this something that was multi before? Weird. Okay, that's fine. Oh man. Done. Hey, cutie. I needed your advice on something earlier, and I forgot what it was. Thank you for the follow. Yes. Go follow Dan, or I'll cry. Oh, it's because we were talking about anime. Volcano. It wasn't the volcano. Hello there. How are you? Um. Someone asked if the Devil May Cry anime was good. And I was like, well, I don't know, I don't know. Like, is it good on its own? I don't know. I, I think, I think, like I said, like, you probably have to have a bit of an attachment to the games. That's it. Oh, anime. <laughs> it's true, Cunning's been a fiend. I can't name any of the fiendish stuff he's done right now, but, you know. Uh, fuck it, let's just use this. I vaguely remember someone saying anime Dante is very different from game Dante. I don't know though, I've never seen it. He's a, he's a lot more mellow. I only got about two or three episodes in before my attention span fucked up and I haven't returned since. And if I do, then I'll start from the beginning again. But yeah, he's very mellow. Well, oh, Mass Castlevania was a good anime. Yeah. I wouldn't have liked a live action. Like, I just, I sound like such a dweeb every time I talk about it because I just, there are so many things. Actually, I, I just think they're quite crap in live action. I'm like, what's the point? Like the thing about like 2D animation is that it's art. Um, nah, it's, I just think there's a lot of effects that they're just never gonna look very good in CGI in comparison to just like seeing them drawn out because you've already got like an extra level of like imagination going on there. And when it's live action, I think it kind of, brings you closer to what's happening in a realist in a realism sense that like you're not as prepared to fill in those blanks my words are not very good i wish i had good words to try to try and talk about the thing that i'm trying to say but yeah i'm saying that then anything that's supposed to be like fun and super dynamic Dan, thank you for giving me the sub Luna fights for weeb supremacy. Apparently I am. You're one of us now. Sorry, not sorry. I like Higgums, have a sub. I like Higgums. I'm glad that Higgums now has ad-free viewing and a shiny badge and some shiny emotes. I know what you mean, I still just prefer live action. I can't see it working well as a live action, but you know, personal preference. Okay, okay. Like, it doesn't mean that then live action thing adaptations are then always like crap, but I just, for me, yeah, as I say, like the animation works better for like 
It doesn't open. No, it's locked. It just doesn't open. Oh, beans. Oh, beans. Let me in. Let me in. Yeah. <gasps> Skellies! What? It's already open. Wait, is this what? No. How peculiar. Would have been better if it was the live action Cowboy Bebop. It. <laughs> what? I I can't even be bothered to watch that now. Obviously, it got slammed so hard. It's, it really did put me off even thinking about watching it at all. Hi, Alistair. Is his peck just pulsing? Is it? Oh my god, you're right! Has it always done that? It's okay, he's better now. The show was so average, which was so unfortunate. Maybe average isn't the worst. It's, it's like, okay, there's this weird thing that occurred in which... Is that Stardust? <gasps> no, it's worse. It's... Oh, gosh. Oh, zero. Three. These are the booby physics I want. We were talking about that earlier, yeah. Apparently lungs is a bad word. Zero, three. Four. Six. Blah, blah, blah. May evil come to the person who attempts to solve the riddle of the number. What the fuck? Sorry, I said booby. I told you, it could have been worse. You could have said lungs. That's some realistic gravity. Gra gravity -ty. Blue footed boobies are a cool bird. Oh no, I've gone to the same place. Can I do the numbers again? That is such a funny sound. Zero. This is still zero three. Zero three four six. Always happy to talk about a booby or a tit. What what do you want from me? What do you want from me? Oh no wait, has he done it again? Oh bollocks. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Let me go. What's bubble to you about booba after all? I thought it was Bobba. I never see lungs in your chat, Luna. I'm civilized. Oh, there's no civility here. I mean, damn, I was I was straight in there talking about how uh, my favorite VTuber models are the ones where inexplicably, like, the boobs expand and and whatever the opposite of spa expand is. Um, yeah, like, they expand and collapse as if, like, the lungs are right inside the boob. I'm like, huh? <laughs> oh, Mr. Sands. Luckily, I only have four hours after I finish my break. Four hours is easy. Hopefully, it'll zoom by. The titty lungs. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what? Contract. Expand and contract. Yeah. Collapse. <laughs> oh, no. My titty. Help, doctor. My titty lung collapsed. Help. I need an ambulance. Help me, Mr. Obama! Yeah, I'm so tired, I need a, I need a bed. Implants can collapse, I think. <laughs> then perish. <laughs> oh god, no, it's, it's an awful, awful Tumblr meme. Um. <laughs> Actually, I don't even remember what it was. It, it was, it was like text messages that then Fuck, I forget the origin. I forget the origins of Obama then perish. <laughs> Please, Mr. Obama, I'm drowning. Ow. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's so hard to explain. There's nothing to explain. It's all just madness. Odd. Tiddy got through, but Tiddy's didn't. Oh, well, there you go. If it's just the one Tiddy, it's okay. 
The internet moves too fast. I'll never be hip. Well, that's the that's the thing that appeals to me still about Tumblr to this day. It never dies. You can say something from like several years ago, and everyone will still be all like, "Oh, a classic! I love that one." You try and put that freaking okay. So I never liked any versions of this. That's not me being a walker. I never liked any of it. But like, it just never hit for me. Not a single one of the Anakin Padme meme format hit for me. And you know, it had its time in the sun so quickly. I feel like if you posted another one of those now, people would be like, "Ugh, stale. What is this crouton? Leave me alone!" Human bone witch, the bone witch. At least we are allowed one. We just need the one. Oh, for God's sake. My fave two are the lesbian archaeologist and the Anthesius Cthulhuus. I vaguely remember that one. I don't remember that one in detail. But I know of it. Cookies! My intent decided not to work this morning, so I'm late to the dragoons, but go ship! I loved it. It was amazing. When that freaking ghost ship came on screen, I'm just like, oh, look at these ragged sails. They are billowing. This is amazing. And it's just really funny because obviously we had the ghost ship in Legend of Zelda last night. And I just, what a fucking treat. Two Legend games, two ghost ships. What a kawinky dink. I didn't plan this. Pure fucking coincidence that I just so happened to, well, you all just so happened to in the Discord vote for Wind Waker, and then I started playing Legend of Dragoon, and it just coincided so perfectly. We got one after the other. I was like, wow. Mental. Yes. Double flash. monthly seems like a fat. I get what you pay. Oh, what are we talking about? Oh, the bi-monthly pay chats. I look at pay stuff, and I'm missing 10 hours, and I have to do the math. So I'm going to spend 10 hours a day. So my pay will be 70 hours, and my pay will be 90 hours. Oh. Yeah, I, I learned about this recently. Um, I don't know if there are any jobs in the UK which are bi-monthly payments. Because um, I saw a tweet from someone being like, hey, Twitch, can we have bi-monthly payouts? And I was like, what? No, why, why would you want that? I don't understand this opinion. Wait, which jobs have bi-monthly payouts? And Taylor was all like, oh yeah, some, some retail jobs in America do. And I'm like, what, why? Like, I can see the benefit, but also I don't like it. I don't get it. I'm currently enjoying weekly pay, especially while I'm boring and not doing anything. When you have to put all your salary on rent and bills, that's bi monthly payments. Oh. Oh no. Awful way to do it. Weekly is best. Well. I don't know why in my, in my like, child brain or something, weekly does say that, but. Too soon. I could deal with weekly. Skint till April. I wonder if like it would make you more responsible. Who knows? Who knows? Shiver me timbers indeed. I'd say it doesn't exist in UK. No, you didn't say that. I, I said it doesn't as far as I know. The conversation didn't go in a direction where you really told me about that. Can't do weekly. Such a fast making sure you've got money set aside for rent every month. That's that's how I would feel. Cause I'd be all like like my 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 dumb bitch brain with my dumb bitch juice. I would be in a place where I thought that I had a lot more money than I did because I'd be getting those payouts like by the week. Rather than obviously having the slow dwindling of my funds. Oh dang it. My ADHD brain impulse control says hi. Oh no. A $20 bottle of booze not worth buying until beginning of the month after bills. It's not worth me buying booze at all right now. Uh, I'm an awful, awful person there. The impulse control it does speak to me. I'm like, hmm, but what if? 
what if I just went on down to Tesco and just bought a load of beer anyway? What if? 100% fair monthly to anything else. It's what I'm used to now as like an expectation as well, I guess. So, yeah, yeah. I think I'm mad wealthy once a month when my Twitch payout comes through in a week after I've ordered dinner three times ago. Ah, fuck. Mm. Yeah. This was one of those months where the payout came through and I was just like, Cause you exchange rate. <laughs> Cause you'll always just see the oh your estimated payout in dollars, and I'll be like, that is great, that is great. So I should I should be able to do this, and like that'll be fine. And then suddenly like, two hundred of that number is gone because of the exchange rate. It's just like this is completely different now. This is awful. I'm gonna have to be frugal. Oh gosh, I may not have to. I can't shower. I can't afford it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm okay. But that's what it does to my brain. Exchange rates are... Oof. I hate it. I'm like, Twitch, you dumb bitch. Can you just not give me these expectations? My my baby, my baby baboon brain it doesn't understand. It see a very big number and go, oh, that's a big number. And then, like I said, 200 of the number is gone by the time it actually translates into my bank. And I... Mm. Mm. Then you have to do your own taxes, etc. Oh, stop it! The ghost ship is spooky enough. Why are we adding these extra elements? Can I get in here now? Oh, it still just doesn't open. Silly ghost pirate ship shenanigans. Let me in. Ooh. Number? Thing thing about number? I couldn't see anything to do in this room, right? Well, I couldn't. I remember the number though. Let me in. Let me in. Um. Hmm. How's everyone's additions doing? Uh, double slash is going well. I can do additions. I like to think I can. See, that's where I fucked up, you know, as 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 a whittle bean who was like, well, I do a lot of reading. Maybe I'll I'll get telepathic powers like Matilda. That dream was crushed quite quickly when like, you know, I watched the movie enough times that I was like, aww, but Matilda can do numbers and stuff. I can't do that. I'll never get my telekinesis. Boo. Sorry, I'm just silently reading the Dutch in my head, like... Oh, oh. Three and seven is ten. <laughs> Stop it. I'm intimidated. Double smack on the wall. <sighs> what do I do now? This is one of those areas where there are so many encounters that I might end up having that it has put me off exploring. Because like I said, the combat is a little bit slow. I love the lasting my incomps. Mm. Yeah, me too. Woo. Me in. <gasps> oh. Hello. Oh, fuck. Captain, please open here. Where are you, Captain? Glub glub. Those pronunciations are pretty good. See, Vera loves me. I wanted Matilda powers, and then it became wanting Harry Potter powers, and then it became wanting Elder Scrolls powers, and then it became wanting free of my capitalist chains. It's crazy how these dreams change as we grow older, right? I love the Skyrim fantasy in which I get into bed, I choose how long I want to sleep, I sleep for that amount of hours, and I wake up feeling well rested. Good shit. 
Crush the dead, let's see how much. So flash that that poor kid eating the chocolate cake. Right? That was something really psychologically scarring about that scene. I feel like I could recite it word for word if I thought hard enough about it. Her sweat and blood went into making this cake and you will not leave until you have finished the entire confection. <laughs> I've never been well rested. Entire confection. Sorry. It's there. It's playing in my head. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Get rid of it. <laughs> the sweat and blood grows me out so bad, right? Oh, man. All the, all the kids in their little assembly chairs like, yeah. Oh, man. The, the bone popping. Wait. Does it say throbbing? Has it always said throbbing? You're lying. Do it again. I need to see. It doesn't. Okay, thank God. I'd have just been shocked that I didn't notice that as one of the various amusing typos in this game. Mario Wilson is a writer now, I think. Uh, yeah, she does things. She, she did write a book, her autobiography. I wanted to read it. I was curious. The only autobiography I've read aside from that was uh, Jacqueline Wilson's. Loved those books. Like, mm, she... She doesn't get enough flipping credit these days, I feel. In the, uh... In the, the British children's writer scene. Like, only if then you're a nerdy academic or some shit, I feel. I don't know. Like, I said this before, I'll say it again. It breaks my little heart that fucking David fucking Walliams is the top children's literature writer. I'm like, this is bull. I hate this. Fuck off. And then people will do that thing where it's like, oh, well, you know, kids read him because they love him. It's like, no, kids read him because he is on the fucking shelves because he's a fucking celebrity fucking writer. So, of course, when they go into Asda, his fucking books are right there. So, of course, then the parents will fucking buy them and then the kiddos will read them. Be all like, that's all right. It's not because he's actually fucking entertaining. Sorry, I got a lot of, I got a lot of anger in me. You know how it comes out. It's all good. I'm fine. Peace and serenity. <laughs> Damn it, Connie. Um, yes, the David Walliams rant. This is one of my faves. David Walliams writes children's books. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I've never heard of this fella. Good for you. Okay, so like that's an entire fucking history here, right? Did you ever hear of a little show came out what? 2004? Little Britain. He and Matt Lucas, who later went on to be like a not companion person in Doctor Who. I don't fucking know. I guess that's probably like then his most internationally known role that I could possibly think of in before he's been in like James Bond or something and I'm like oh well you know what nobody watches that so actually it wouldn't have been a great example sorry wink wonk um I don't want to talk about Little Britain no Dan I've got we've got to talk about it a little bit to kind of illuminate the entire history of why it really is just part of the horrible cultural makeup of modern Britain and why we have so many bloody people we can't fucking talk to because it just turns into, hey, that's, well, that was racist. Oh, now it's funny. <laughs> this is what it's like maneuvering through certain generations. Actually, we can't even call it generations, can we? But, ugh. All right, let me in this door. Do I need the number? It's us, Captain's Cabin. I love coming in mid rant. Hi, Red. I, I yeah, I, I can't. I'm so glad I always hated Little Britain. It makes me feel discerning. I'm proud of you. I wish I wish that were me. Unfortunately, I was a child when it came out and filled with all of the problematics of, of all of the things. This is why, you know, I hate the internet purity culture where it's just like, you did not fucking pop out of the womb pure and you should not expect anyone else to. It's all about fucking growing and realizing you were wrong, innit? Anyway, so. Hey, Red. <laughs> 
<laughs> hey, Agni! I'm getting some modern day rolling vibes here. Modern day? Well, that's the thing, like... Because <sighs> I especially do this thing of obviously because of the age that I am or also, you know, you just, you, you look back on your own personal experiences of what you remember from then like over a decade ago and obviously it, it gets all mulchy and you are like, oh, I didn't remember it like that. Like, of course you didn't. But anyway, the point is that for the time that Little Britain came out, even then, like it, this wasn't like when you watch something from the 70s and like it's still gross as fuck but there is then just that thing in your head of just like well yeah that's what they wrote in the 70s and you've got that nice cozy distance from from the then and the here so that you can then just enjoy the still enjoyable bits but the time the freaking LB came out, it, like I said, it was like 2005 or something. So on one hand, you've got that shit coming out. On the other hand, you've got, I don't know, like Russell T Davis writing coming out. Um, and like, it did not match. That that show should not have been coming out in, in the fucking early 2000s. Cause yeah, uh, all of your fun boys were there. Your fucking, your, your, your anti-trans, your, your fucking, your homophobia, your racism, like those black face in this. They, they actually went on to make another show, didn't they? That fucking Come Fly With Me, which was an absolute flop. But that was, what? Again, this wasn't even later. This was like, when the fuck did Come Fly With Me come out? Like 2009? That had blackface. Um. Anyway, like I said, all of your fun things and you are just like, when you look it up and it's like, it is no word of a lie. There is no hyperbole here. There's no gray area. The year that was coming out. Anyway, so this guy, David Williams, you now look at his freaking children's books and it's pretty much Little Britain light. And it's so, yeah, it's really fun to know that he's the top children's author. 2000s were wild. I think it was earlier than 2005. Yeah, it might, it might have been. It's, it's the come fly with me is the, is the one where I'm like, that one was very late in the 2000s. Yeah, okay, 2003? Okay. Well, I don't mind. I, I don't feel like a failure for mixing up my 2003 and my 2005. I'm working off memory here. I was like, what? Seven? I don't know. Seems like it's not opening. Well, I need it to. <laughs> Let me in. I need the numbers thing. Oh God, leave me alone. No, fuck. Quite enjoyed their problematic accents. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come fly with me it was 2010. How long did it last? It flopped. I know it flopped, but they still got a BBC One spot. I'm glad. I'm I'm glad that they just they they put that they don't try and hide that. Yes. Just so I don't have to flip in, sound like a liar for a little bit. No! Oh god, I hope when it broke down it wasn't in a, in a scary situation. I hope it was just that you tried to start it up and it went, no. Oh yeah, there you go. There's your, there's your lunar, lunified history of the rage that I feel every time that I see that fucker's books. And <laughs> even more fun, obviously Taylor did his whole teaching in a high school thing. <laughs> I get the second hand pleasure of hearing that actually straight up into like year nine. That's, that's what they bring in. Like, oh, love my fucking David Walliams books for ages freaking eight to 12. Good shit. Yes. Me crying like, you don't have to like reading, but here's some Garth Nix. Can you just try this for me, please? Do you want this E.B. White, please? I think you're lucky to give it a chance. He's <laughs> actually bankrupting the kids. Yeah. 
No, I lucked out. It was down the street from my house. Had to push it about a mile. Talk about a workout. Fuck, did no one help you? Boo. Oh my gosh. Damn. Damn. They don't encourage kids to stop reading kids' books. Ugh. I get it. Teachers be fucking shattered. No, it was early morning. Uh, at least that meant the roads was empty. Definitely lucked out. Ugh, leave her alone! Ow! Poor little Meru. Uh... Jesus. I might have to replace her for a bit. She's, uh... Not doing very well with the, uh, not getting damaged things. Defend me from a comedy standpoint. There's lowest common denominator. No thought, no brain. It's just lazy gags, cat phrases, and bad taste. That's what I mean. From a child's perspective, I could enjoy the odd thing. And then I learned... Gaspless? Gaspless! Oh my god. What a funny name. Gaspless. Blue wisps are attracted to the blue hair, apparently. Oh god, it's coming through. No! No, it's the dress, isn't it? Oh fuck. I didn't think about this. I did not gear up for a ghost ship encounter. <laughs> oh god. Tim, no! Tim, no! <laughs> oh, the, the Bartimaeus. Taylor remembers. Taylor remembers the things. See, I missed out a little bit on um, a bunch of these, like, funky books that everyone else who, who read as a kiddo seems to remember because maybe I was a little bit too into my Jacqueline Wilson or something. Missed out on the Percy Jackson. Missed out on the fucking... Oh, brain. Oh, don't glitch like that. Um... Shan. Shan. I, I missed out on that. What is this? Hello. Ghost crew A. Help me. The fiend. The fiend is. I don't want to die. Help. That was my really bad Scooby-Doo ghost voice. What? Oh, fuck. This is Ghost Crew B. Yeah. We cannot make it. We'll be killed by him. Ooh. We're Molly and Molly. Oh. We're Molly and Molly. Can we watch Muppets Christmas Carol even though it's March? What are they talking about? Uh... <laughs> well, fuck. Oh! Another door that I haven't tried! Hello! No. I'm sorry. Once was enough. What do you mean once was enough? Every year, Kyle. Every year. Fine. You're right. It would be a lot more appropriate for us to watch Muppets Treasure Island. And it's rusty and doesn't work at all. Boo. Three numbers? But I don't know three numbers. Should we combine the numbers that those ghosts were saying and input them here? But if there's only three numbers, they said four, technically. So the first one was zero, but you know. Uh. Well, we can try. Three. Four. Six. This is how we unlock Vincent. It doesn't open. No! Do we have to do addition? Three, four, and six. That doesn't help. Does it? The first number could be zero. So maybe zero, one, three? No, no, wait, come back. If, if we added them all together. 
I don't know. I'm just throwing spaghetti at the wall here. Oh, I had high hopes for that one as well, you know. Ooh, 13, spooky number. Whoa. Eight more times. I'll come back later then. Don't throw spaghetti at the wall, just fucking taste a bit. I just like the phrase now. Oh my god, it's your one from, from Dark Souls 3. I did remember another one. How could I forget the, the big skelly boy? How could I forget the really desperate to help backseaters? It's taught me to be really clear on my thought process when I'm whacking at bosses so that we don't have a hit hit the bang hit hit the bangles I'm fucking hitting the bangles thanks for your help anyway I'm calm I've actually got a really serene temperament I think just munching on that wall spaghetti well nah, that's the one that's the boy Jenna, please try yumping on bangles what is the clear thought process? Uh, I don't know. Oh my god, we haven't saved. Help. Bongo. Hit bongo. <laughs> no! Mm. Um. I've never seen a treasure island without the Muppets, apart from Treasure Planet, which I don't know if it counts or not. That was one of the most horrific things I've ever seen when that crew crew member, like they've established that, you know, there's anti-grav and so like when he's floating up in the sky, he's just gonna float forever until he hits space and then chokes to death. Good fridge horror. Dana, if you were just doing it right, they wouldn't have backseated. Damn. Dannington. Danathy. <laughs> Where am I going? She looks gonna hit me again. Gonna do it. Gonna smash. Saturday. I'll free up some time. Damn it, Mm-hmm. If only there was another bit of media with interesting and consistent space physics you could watch. Well, I definitely can't watch it right now. Taylor's round. No, leave her alone. Good night, sweet Maru. Um, actually, it's Dan and... Oh. Just fixing my awkward emote cash on my mobile. Castlevania on Netflix. Fly. Shaking my head, my head. I could rewatch Buffy again. It's been a couple of months. Shut up, Gunning. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. Let's get that perfect. Yeah! We did it! I said let's get that perfect! I got the perfect! Amazing! Who'd have known? I don't even need to do this! Look! It's just a sad little blueberry. It's just a little on flambe blueberry. The fuck? And yet, you know what? That dragoon attack, it's not always okay, is it? You need to watch the latest kingdom, um, seasons of the last kingdom and the witch. Er. <laughs> Which, which, uh, witchiest? Yeah, it's actually a uh, little known fact that the uh, first season is actually just the witch. They, uh, they go up by a uh, superlative. So when we get a season three, that'll be the witchiest. Letting you know. Shut up, Taylor. What's the last new thing you liked? Ow. Uh. Hmm. 
doesn't mean that I don't like my, my new stuff. It just means that there's stuff that I want to go back and watch. Well, everything I watch is new. Because I'm not boring. That's a bold claim that I don't think anyone should make. Final burst! Wow. Some fire for your fire? My dear, my dear Flamio. Time for Dad's rant about devs! Woo! Today, they effed up a website launch so bad that I'll be working till 11 to fix it. Oh no! When you started the story, I thought that it would be a, a rant of uh, it's concluded at least, or at least nothing that you then have to deal with. <sighs> I'm so sorry. Christ. I hope you then don't have to work so hard tomorrow, but I don't know if this is a fool's hope. Citation needed, I <laughs> No. No citation needed. Unless you mean for Taylor's I'm not boring. What if new stuff is boring and not cozy? Right? We also don't get paid over time. <sighs> Fucking devs. Where are my thingies? Yeah, we, we're gonna have to get rid of you, Mary. We'll go and put rolls in instead. Did we ever heal her after? Did we ever get a chance to go to bed? I don't remember. Burn the workplace down! Oh gosh. Had a violent image of that dodo from Alice in Wonderland. Like I always say, it's it's the it's the animated 50s one from Disney that always freaks me the out, out the most. One of the ones as well with, is when Alice is freaking stuck inside the white rabbit's house and then that dodo comes along and he's like, ah, I know how we'll get rid of your problem. We'll burn your house down. Yay! Oh, Albert, why are you so strong? If something new is boring, then you find something else new. Easy, there's so many options. No. We head into a spiral of despair. Die. More and more. Whereas what you've already seen, you know what's gonna happen. Haha, -ha, this is where you're wrong. My memory is awful. So I might have forgotten. I'd be like, wow, I've watched this seven times and I completely forgot about that. Oh my god, what a great scene. I forgot about that. What the fuck? She just got here. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm bringing her to life. Go <sighs> away, oh, ship ghosts. I like to find the new things and things I've rewatched over and over again. This is the new new chat split. There's no more Team Purple, that's old news. This is our new personal chat personality quiz, is are you okay with watching the same stuff again and again, or are you like, no, new content, new, new, new. Why, why do we keep missing the little flame and blue? Mm. You're bringing her to life in front of death? That's rude. It's just showing off my power. What the heck is all of this one-shot nonsense? Right, we're bringing out the big boy. I just rewatch stuff, but also watch new stuff. I contain multitudes. Right? Like, there's an implication here that we then don't watch anything new at all. And I'm like, well, that's just not bloody true, is it? That's just not true. 
can't pay enough attention to something I've already seen enough to find anything new. Uh, here we go. Mm. Let's get rid of death. I'm going to kill chaos. That's what you're doing, because every stream is like new stuff. It's, it's like new stuff. Hey! I always go back to watch beloved shows. Go get him, Rose. You didn't urge anything new for forever. You say it yourself. Oh, what? Watch? Rogue! Run while you can! No, there's no need to run. We got we got dragoon wings. We can we can glide away. How was your stream? <laughs> Gotta mix up my shots where I go mad. Can't be doing Aldi or Sames twice in a row. I try and then maybe one day she'll remember me and stop asking me for my ID when I go to buy energy drink. Ow. This is the worst bloody enemy. It doesn't deserve to be this much of a pain in the bum. <gasps> Final Fantasy 14. Were you just messing around or doing some story stuff? I, I cancelled my subscription this month. I was like, I have not touched it since I subscribed again and I can't. Okay, let's please get rid of this bad bean. Or not. <sighs> No? No. My heart is broken. But I am famished. My my crops, they grow on arid soil. Die. Nice getting back in here also. I know. Hmm. I'm not good at putting aside time to do things that I say that I want to do. Just carry on my stamina. Oh, why am I so... No. Coffee, help. What do you mean it's five o'clock? Oh, I'm fine. I've had a day. Okay, um... What am I to do? This has actually been a very confusing time for me. Go, go away. No, oh, this isn't happening. I'm not making out of here without an encounter, am I? Oh gosh, am I? Wow, amazing. Let me in. <gasps> Let me in. I don't think you're trying hard enough, Dot. Ugh. I'm fine. We're having that fun scenario where actually, you know what, if there's a puzzle to be had, I don't remember how I'm supposed to solve it because I'm just getting overwhelmed with enemy ghosts. I'm like, go away. Shoot. Oh no, I'm all out of trans rights. Oh gosh, what about, what about Black Rain? We could get the, no, let's not do that. No, we could do that, maybe. Uh, well the meteor fall, it'll do something. Luna having these GDQ strats. Oh, I wish. Could have been worse. Uh, don't die, Rose. Albert's gonna die. Or not. Because the enemies ain't smart. Okay, right. Let's go. So many meteors for only 83 damage? It ain't like your Final Fantasy meteor. Was it Final Fantasy 8 where we had meteor? I can't remember. Oh. Oh. We got no magics. Ugh. <sighs> Oh. He 
still so strong. Wind power to summon. I think I remember fighting Garuda. It's been so long for so many things. Part of me is just like, damn, I just want to start again. But I don't know. I don't think it would be good for me. Ah, leave him be. Um, let's try our best. It would be okay if some of these enemies didn't have a bloody monster kill. Like, oh no, finally a reason to put on one of my items that I've just been ignoring for so long because we got a, uh, a ring that was meant to protect against instant death a long while ago. So I was like, well, I've had no cause to use this, have I? The theme was awesome. I enjoy Shiva's theme. I never got even. I never even got to the part where I fight Shiva, but I'm like, I heard the theme. Oh god, run! Uh, uh. Oh, leave me alone. I'm tired. I don't know where we're supposed to go to to find the numbers. Did I miscalculate? See the things on my walk to work area. Don't mind me. Just skipping the opening, you know how it is. Do -do -do. Sometimes you do get to the point where you gotta skip the opening. I'm still so upset with my bloody Disney Plus play a thing so obviously a lot of these streaming sites even youtube in fact they will have these fun features now where it will just pop up with a are you still watching why like, don't you fucking patronize me yeah i am and um i've been waiting for the longest time for uh, some some clever kind person to come out with a chrome extension to do that for disney um well, somebody did, but it only sort of works. Because Disney Plus does this really fun thing. Well, so the extension, I think, is supposed to then just... It, it does skip opening, skip recap, and continue playing. But because of the fun thing that Disney Plus does, it sometimes just freaking yoinks you away from the show you're watching and just drops you back on the homepage. So obviously then there is nowhere for program to press continue playing so that's when it gets ruined <laughs> they want you to go away i um i looked it up once for the youtube one and uh some people theorized that it was to do with um i can't remember now but something to do with space Nice time for the Luna podcast. What's on today? Oh god, you've missed the real. You've missed the real meat. We had some flipping weeby talk. We had some flipping discussions about freaking David Walliams and we had a big old rant. Um, we saw a massive ghost. We were on the massive ghost ship, but the FMV, oof. I was living. I was thrilled. I felt so undead at the start, but now I'm truly alive. Christ, what other shit did we talk about today? So much. So, so much. I feel like we talked about... Oh, we had a big talk about bugs at the start. Nasty bugs. Awkwardly pretty bugs, but still household pests. Lord bug talk. Had a horrible moment where Rose's awkward Irish accent, then talking to the freaking... The, my, my class freaking shitty fucking whatever the other one is and I was just like oh please don't talk to each other I, I can't keep up I couldn't keep up when Lavitz was supposed to be Scottish and you were supposed to be Irish I can't do it my, my fucking switching it's not that fast it's not good enough I need time to settle in I need time to settle in so that it doesn't sound like a disaster but it's okay Rose is very antisocial so she said nothing at all I was like good going baby I love you um yeah. And now we're stuck in constant combat. 
can't find my way out. I'm getting confused. Confused and upset. Uh, right, let's, let's just go. Because I also thought this would be a nice time to maybe like level some of the uh, player skill thingamabobbies, bobby my things. Now I'm regretting it. Thank you for the follow. Uh, go get him. Dang it. Mm. Stop throwing your bones. It's nasty. <sighs> Genuinely on the edge of just asking what I'm supposed to do because it's taking a long time. And I thought I've gone through every room. I'm about 50% done with the Rose Glam and it's of her in Dragoon form. <gasps> Cutie. I need to, I need to up her spirit thing on the bobby so we can dragoon her. Even though she doesn't have the uh, the double slash blew my mind. <laughs> Everyone misses volcano. Everyone. I need to look it up because now we're in the past of the game. I have bits and pieces of. Yeah, I just I, I my impatience when we're in one of those bloody situations where there's something that I need to figure out, track down, and I can't think because I'm streaming and, and chatting and then I move a couple of paces and, you know, um, enjoy enemy encounter again. The IGN guide is a shambles, just a massive paragraph of text. Oh, disgusting. Goodbye. I can't believe Twitch is about to be uninstalled forever. This part of the game is the most tedious and hard to remember. That's such a shame. I was so hyped for Ghost Ship, and now we're here, and now... Yeah. It's just one of those areas that I'm not able to focus on very well when I'm supposed to be streaming. <laughs> Screw IGN, it's all about game facts. It is all about game facts, let's be honest. Chijolo from 2007. Good egg, probably. Okay, uh. Ah! No! Fuck off! I'm the only person who reads this game FAQ. No, you're not. You're not. This is another fun split of who says game facts, who says game FAQs. I think that's a fair split. I regularly use it for the older game missables. Oh, yeah. Um. Hmm. I can't remember the last game I used it for now. It was probably Final Fantasy. I'm with Gareth on this one. It's it's me and my annoying habit to want to to just shorten certain words. I only because my brother does, I think. Sweet potato roasting experience. Uh... What do you mean by soft? What do you mean? It's not you, Luna. Facts is a very common way to say it. Well, like, it's not just me. They just kind of melted one time I tried. Uh, lots of oil. Lots of oil and a good temperature. Boil them a bit. Stick them in the pan. Gonna make falafel and sweet potato wraps later. That sounds really, really good. Taylor made a really, really good soup, but I just, I just wanted to get back to stream. 
because I knew we'd be here. I knew we'd be in a situation where it was five o'clock and I felt I would feel like I've done nothing. I miss using game shocks to mess with the game here heard. Who would do such a thing? That sounds like criminal activity. I'm so glad that when I can't contribute, there's lots of other people who are like, I have information for you. I'm here. I love this community. Cries. Go away, Wispy. Just shoot. Yes. Double flash. <sighs> Hurry up. Hush. Die. More and more. <sighs> I should have got more coffee. I think it would have been a smart move from me. get asymmetrical stockings in Final Fantasy 14. Per stream then I'm going to chug coffee. Might do, might do. Oh fuck, go away. Shoot. Why am I cursed? Wasn't this one? <sighs> Gonna lurk and concentrate. Good luck. Uh -huh. Fine. I'm fine. For the first time, can we just do this? Can we just? Right, let's go. to the sad point where it's somewhat worse that it's not a random encounter I'm just more upset that then it's something that I can see that I can avoid and then I just watch myself not avoid it basically yeah zero three four six so why then for the one freaking chest with a three number code does that not really make sense? But he go, we should write down the numbers the ghost said. What do you want from me? No, no, why would I have got that? <sighs> Trying to just move around the bloody ship. It's grinding my gears. Go away. Shoo. <gasps> Wait, that door's open now. I have no idea when that door opened, but it's open now. Fuck me. I hope it's not random guesswork. Nah. I think at least it's not that. When and why did that door open? Who knows? <gasps> it's the top hat ghost! With, with the cane and the monocle. Oh my gosh. Spooky, scary skeleton, sun shows down your spine. <laughs> Purple slime, huh? Nah, he's pulling the top hat. Okay, right. Why can't we. Dart isn't ready? For Christ's sake, boy. Yes. There we go. Double flash. Surely we're ready now. Maybe. No? Okay, that's fine. We won't we won't do it all then. It's probably for the best that we don't. Yeah. So obviously we can't use items when we're in that zone. <laughs> it's 
See, maybe this is why I should bring Shauna out more, but... Oh fuck, I forgot. I forgot! Oh, I was like, it's okay, I'll just use Burst Storm. No, you won't. Fool. I do love the Rose Storm effect. I love it more every time Rose is in the party because I'm just like imagining the side eye like what you talk about. Oh, leave her be! Stinky behavior. Uh, give it to E. Don't die, Rose. I love it. I love that her max health is so high now, but I just I can't get her to a decent point where it matters. I have info on the number in chest if slash when you want it. Hooray! Thank you so much. I found a, a new a new bit of progress. So maybe I might get through this without embarrassment. I can say. Afternoon, Liam. Ow! I'm being injured. Right. The gaspless. It's very tempting. But now we're gonna do the worst storm. What a trio. Pretty. Like, I definitely just want to imagine so many of these effects. Modern graphics. I want to see that HD. There's something I I picked in on Taylor playing the Stranger Paradise demo, and there's something about some of the faces that looks really off. I remember last night. You were playing Remember Me. Incidentally, um, double flash. Don't die, Rose. Simply don't die. Well, you know what? She's not dead. So I think that's a success. know what to say. You don't even know. Okay. That was way too soon. What am I doing? Hey okay, Luna, how'd you feel about male trees? Kidding, I've really lost steam. <laughs> it's one of those days. Also, I keep thinking of all the chores I need to do. She's not even got the energy. I've actually not got the energy. Uh -huh. I can't even human you. Like. I keep beating up all these skeletons and I haven't got a, a, hu a humorous bone to give you. 